Have you seen my broom? No. <coughs> but I wish you'd find it and sweep up the dust. Can I help it if it's a windy day? Have you found your broom yet, Sebastian? No. I think it's lost forever. Oh. Well, as long as you can't sweep, how about finding some big rocks? With this wind, we need them to hold the tent flaps down. You can carry them in this basket. I don't see why we need big rocks. It isn't that windy. Oh. There, I'm all ready. Oh, oh dear. Where are you going all dressed up, Lily? I'm going to town to meet my Aunt Vera for lunch. She's taking me to a very special restaurant. Why don't I ever get asked out to a very special restaurant for lunch? Well, Sebastian, if you dress a little more neatly, you just might. But, Lily, how can I dress more neatly? It's my job to mingle with dirt. <laughs> oh, Sebastian, it's such a silly... <laughs> oh, dear, I, I have to go. Bye-bye. Oh, oh, dear! <laughs> Why by yourself? Lily gets big fancy lunches, and I get to select big heavy rocks. A rump. Nothing good ever happens to me. <laughs> It's a necklace, and a pretty one at that. <laughs> now this is exciting. Well, let's see, what are these? Um, no, no, it's not really me. I wonder what I could do with this. After all, as the saying goes, finders keepers, losers weepers. Everybody knows that. You know, I bet I could trade this necklace for all sorts of good things. <laughs> What do you think this is worth? This little bangle. Oh, what an angle! I'll trade it for something that I think is swell. And when they say, where'd you get that? I won't tell. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. Nobody can say a word. If anyone asks, where'd you get that nice thing? I'll say from a little bird. And if somebody says, hey, I want what you've got, it's certainly going to cost him a lot. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. At least that's what I've always heard. A mountain of chocolate ice cream. No, I'm afraid. I wouldn't trade. It'll have to be something that fits for a king. Sebastian, you've got it made. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. And nobody can say a word. If anyone asks where you get that nice thing, I'll say from a little bird. 
word, and if somebody says, hey, I want what you've got, it's certainly going to cost him a lot. Finders keepers, losers weepers, at least that's what I've always heard. <laughs> Boy, all this good luck makes me tired. I think I'll just take a little cat nap. Ah, I'll just hide my new necklace right here under this rag until I wake up. Let's see here, Barnaby. Uh, we need popcorn, peanuts, balloons, hot dogs, and uh, cannonballs. Gee, all of that. And more, because we need lemonade, a new harness for Dumbo, and some banners. Uh, gee, uh, we need a lot of things, Barnaby. Uh, here, I don't think it's too far into town. Back in a flash. Uh, say, uh, are you sure you can handle this job alone, Barnaby? No problem, Lionel. No problem at all. Well, okay. Uh, but maybe you should take the trike here. Gee, uh, are you sure nobody else wants to use it? Well, I, I thought Sebastian was going to use it to carry rocks, but, uh, well, I, I, I don't see him anywhere. Uh, now, go ahead. Uh, Sebastian's probably finished with it. Okie dokie. Stop, look, turn around, listen. Something nice is about to be missing. You thought no one would ever spot it. Oh, just look at these strawberry pies. Oh, they're beautiful, my dear. Why, they look just like rubies. Like the stone in my necklace. My, my, my necklace. Oh, no. It's gone. Oh, dear. Now, now, don't worry. Let's take a look around. Maybe the chain broke. <laughs> Never mind, ladies. You just find that necklace. I'll clean up uh, what's left of the restaurant. Oh, very well, young man. Uh, your necklace isn't here, Lily. Oh, but uh, we, we'll find it. Have faith, child. Oh, I hope so, Aunt Vera. It's my favorite necklace. Well, we'll simply look outside. We'll look all over. Why, all we need is a little bit of luck. Uh, uh, Sebastian, what are you doing under that wagon? I thought you were going to get some big rocks. Oh, uh, oh, uh, well, oh, rocks. Uh, yeah, oh, oh, yes, yes, a oh, rock. I was looking for rocks under the wagon. Uh -huh. Big rocks, little rocks. Uh, oh, I must have fallen asleep while I was, uh, I rocked myself to sleep, you might say. <laughs> uh, never mind. This is very hard work, you know. Yeah, okay, okay. But now that you've had your rest, you'd better go get those rocks. But the trike's gone. Where is it? I needed to carry the rocks back. But Barnaby took it to town. I guess that's what happens when you fall asleep on the job. <laughs> dum de dum da la de da -de. Oh, hiya, Sebastian. Uh, how would you like one of my... Super duper delicious bananas. Oh, uh, well, uh, please don't bother me now, cutie. You see, I am very busy. Oh, bananas. Oh. oh, I'm sorry, Sebastian. I was only trying to help you. Help me? Wait, cutie. Why, look at you. You're the strongest one in the whole circuit. I am? Oh, yeah, I, I guess I am. You sure are. In fact, with the job I have to do today, I wish I was as strong as you, cutie. Oh, gee, sweeping doesn't take much strength, Sebastian. Rooms are real light. But it is not sweeping, cutie. This is a very important job, and it takes a lot of strength. Well, hey, I'm extra strong. Oh, please, 
Please let me help Sebastian. I like helping. Well, okay, buddy old pal. Since you really want to, follow me. Hey, Liz, just look at this mess. Oh, popcorn, harness, mm, cannonballs. Wow, what a beautiful necklace. It almost looks like it's winking at me. Uh -huh. I wonder if it's a magic necklace. Oh boy, this necklace looks just like the one in my magic book. It is magic. I just know it. Now everyone will know that I'm a great magician and not just a mere clown. I think I'll try just one little magic trick right now. Oh boy, I see. Oogly, oogly, oogly pie. With this magic necklace right here, let Barnaby, let me fly. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Huh. This must be the wrong place to try a magic trick. Too many leaves. Whoa! Yeah, definitely too many leaves. Gee, Sebastian, all oh, I'm finding are little itty bitty rocks. Well, we'll just have to keep looking until we find Barnaby. I, I mean, until we find the big rock. <whistles> Is that Barnaby? Oh, no, no, it's only Lily and her aunt. Oh, hello, Lily. Hi there. Hey, have you seen Barnaby? No, we haven't, Sebastian. But I'd like you and QT to meet my Aunt Vera. Oh, yes. How do you do? How do you do? Charmed, I'm sure. Uh, <laughs> uh, say, uh, we've been looking high and low for Lily's lost necklace. Uh, have either of you seen it around? Necklace? Yes, it had a beautiful red stone in it. I don't know what could have happened to it. Well, uh, uh don't look at me. I, I certainly don't have it. Uh, see, see, uh, 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 you can check for yourself. Oh, I believe you, Sebastian. We just asked if you'd seen it. Oh. Uh, I haven't seen your necklace either, Lily. But I'll be looking real hard now that I know that you lost it. Oh, we both will, won't we, Sebastian? Oh, of course, yes. Why, we'll both be looking everywhere. You can count on that, Lily. Oh, thank you, Sebastian. You too, QT. Oh, yes. Uh, many thanks. Uh, uh, good day. Uh, uh, Lily, my dear, are you sure that Sebastian Bella is trustworthy? He seems sneaky, even if he is a cat. Oh, my Aunt Vera. Why, of course. Everyone at Dumbo Circus is my friend. Listen, QT, I think we should split up. We'll have a better chance of finding Rock for Lionel. You go that way, and I'll look over there. Okay, Sebastian. <coughs> now, where is Barnaby and that old trike? I want that necklace back. After all, it's mine. I found it. Finders keepers, losers weepers, and nobody can say a word. If anyone asks, where'd you get that nice thing? I'll say from a little bird. And if somebody says, hey, I want what you got, it's certainly going to cost him a lot. Finders keepers, losers weepers, at least that's what I've always heard. Oh, rat, not again. Now, where did those come from? Those rocks weren't there the last time I came by. Oh, boy, this is impossible. 
I sure could use some help. Oh, hey there, Barnaby. QT, here's just the fella I need. Could you possibly help me move these big rocks out of the way? I have to get back to the circus, you see. Oh, sure, Barnaby. I can move them as easy as banana cream. Oh. Wow. Thanks, QT. Uh, See you later, alligator. <laughs> alligator? I'm not an alligator. I'm an orangutan. I hope these rocks are big enough. Why, this one doesn't feel very heavy. Head, Sebastian. Oh, QT, why'd you do that? This rock weighs a ton. It does. Gee, it doesn't feel very heavy. If you had more bananas, you wouldn't think it was heavy either. Never mind that. Say, look at all those rocks you've got. Yeah, pretty good, huh? <laughs> I just moved them out of Barnaby's way. Barnaby was here? I've got to catch him. Uh, uh, QT, you bring the rocks. No, sure thing, Sebastian. Thanks, QT. <laughs> Wow! This must be Lily's necklace! Oh boy, oh boy, I'm so glad I found it! Lily will be so happy! Now, where is that dog? He certainly is taking a long time. Ha ha! There he is! There he is! Barnaby! Here, let me help you unload, Barnaby. Oh, hey, wait a minute. My magic book. And my, and my magic necklace. Oh, where's my magic necklace? Your magic necklace? You don't have a magic necklace, Barnaby. Oh, yes, I do. No, you don't. Oh, yes, I do. You do? Well, I did. I found it lying on the ground when everything fell out of the basket. Barnaby, just this morning, that very necklace flew out of the air and bopped me on the head. And you know what that means? No, what does it mean? It means that I found the necklace first. And finders, keepers, losers, weepers. Well, that's a silly saying. Anyway, the necklace isn't here. It must have fallen out of the basket again. Well, I'm going to find it. Now. Where did I leave my metal detector? Oh, so it wasn't a magic necklace. Shucks. No wonder I couldn't fly. <laughs> Beauty, wait! Thank you, T. Way up! QT, wait! QT, it's me, your friend, Sebastian. Wait! That sounds like Sebastian. He is Sebastian! I don't see him anywhere. Wait for me! Oh, 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 look, everyone. Uh, I found Lily's beautiful necklace out in the woods. Oh, QT! You're my hero! I'm sure glad this necklace belongs to you, Lily. I know how bad I would feel if I lost something special, like my calliope. Oh, thank you so much, QT. Gosh, I found that necklace too. I guess it was wrong to keep it. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. 
It's just not the right thing to do. Hey, if you come across something somebody's lost, then it doesn't belong to you. I am someone by F, where'd you get what you've got? It's something that somebody misses a lot. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. I found out it's really not true. Mm -hmm. Barnaby, uh, if you found the necklace, why didn't you try to find the person who lost it? I just didn't think about it, I guess. Well, anyhow, Sebastian told me it was his because he found it first. Uh, Sebastian? Uh, you found Lily's necklace, too? And you didn't tell me? Well, uh, well, uh, you know the old saying. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers, you know. Why, Sebastian, it's wrong to keep something that belongs to somebody else. Yes, I guess you're right. I'm sorry, Lily. Well, as long as you're sorry, I, I guess it's all right. Oh, good. I'm glad you're not mad. No, I'm not mad. In fact, just to show you that I'm not mad, I want to give you something. You do? Some chocolate? No, it's something you lost. Something I lost? Yes. You see, I always give back things I find. It's very wrong to keep things that belong to other people. Oh, it certainly is. Oh, give it back, Lily. Here you go, Sebastian. I found your broom. Now you can sleep. Oh, oh, no, no. <laughs> no, that's okay, Lily. Finders keepers, I always say. Oh, no, no, no. We all learned our lesson, Sebastian. Just because you find something doesn't mean it's yours. Well, just well. Why does this always happen to me? <laughs> I sure hope you enjoyed our story, boys and girls. And now it's time for you to sing and dance along with us. Are you ready? Then let's go! <laughs> I'm an elephant too, and I can do what the elephants do. I can flap my ear, wave my trunk, and do a turn or two like the elephants do. What do elephants do when another one comes into view? They flap their ears, wave their trunk. And do a turn or two, that's what elephants do. Elephants swaying back and forth to a jungle deep. Elephants walking through the trees on the very big, very big feet. You're an elephant too. And you can do what the elephants do. You can flap your ear. Wave your trunk. And do a turn or two like the elephants do. Like the elephants do. Like the elephants do. Like the elephants do. <laughs> that was a lot of fun, but that's not all. The sideshow is just about to start. Come on, let's not miss it. Today, QT has a good safety tip for you, so watch real closely, boys and girls. He's going to show you how not to hurt yourself when you're lifting something heavy. Let's watch. Hey! <laughs> Oh, my aching back. This is just too heavy to lift. Gee, Sebastian, you look tired. Tired? Sure I'm tired. Sebastian's work never ends. Lift this, Sebastian. Lift that, Sebastian. I'm trying to lift this trunk, and it is just too heavy. Say, QT, why don't you give it a try? Okay. Well, 
You're just very strong. Well, you have to lift it the right way. You always lift heavy stuff with your legs. With your legs? Yeah. Don't ever lift heavy stuff with your back. See? It's much harder this way, and it hurts my back. Let's see now. Lift with your legs and not with your back. Uh-huh. Now, that makes sense. Too bad I didn't know that before I tried to lift this trunk. St. Keith, could you show me that again? Sure thing, Sebastian. <sighs> see? Lift with your legs and not with your back. Uh, say, QT, uh, while you've got that trunk up in the air, how's about carrying it over to the wagon? It's my pleasure, Sebastian. And thanks for the lesson. Lift with your legs and not with your back. Lift with your legs and not with your back. I think I've got it. I'll remember that the next time. Meanwhile... <laughs> I better take a little nap, so I'll be ready when I have to lift something else. <laughs> yowza, yowza! What an effort! What a show! What a circus! What? What? Our time is up for today? Well, don't worry, folks. Dumbo Circus will be back very soon. You make sure you're back, too. Bye-bye for now. Thank you.